Hey y'all, it's Martha here. Um, I was approached by a company called New Craft Today, and they asked me what I like to do in unboxing, and they generously offered me uh, so, a certain amount of money to spend to go on their website and choose some things that I would like. And they have lots of different things. They had um, diamond paintings. They had uh, scrapbook supplies. They had a lot of different things. I believe they had some beading supplies and just a lot of different things. So I scoured the website and chose a few things. And I have opened the bag, but I and I kind of browsed at what it was because I forgot. I didn't think it was coming that fast. Uh, I think it was about... I don't even know if it was two weeks or not. I don't, I don't really know. But I was just surprised it was out there already. So I kind of looked at them. But I did not open the individual packages. So this is the three items I chose and we will open them together and see what it's all about so this and you will find in the description a link to these three products you will find a link to the website and you also find a 10% off coupon code which is Martha 10 so please go check them out and see what they got and you'll probably find something that you could use too so this is a book and it's a collection of old things it says if i had a single flower for every time i think about you i could walk forever in my garden oh that's pretty so this is 20 pages and i believe it's a book of stickers i don't or maybe it's for fussy cutting um, I believe it's stickers, but you have to cut them out. Oh, no, they're not. They See, they peel this way. Yeah, I can't even see the lines around them. They're really small. I mean, it doesn't look that deep. But anyway, yes, they are individual stickers, and they're very beautiful. So, I like this. A lot of pretty stickers. So, we'll flip through it here. A lot of good uh, stickers for some spring crafting. Uh, I can't read that without a magnifying glass. I don't think. But anyway, it's a pretty little quote. Then we have some that look like, um, I don't know, that might kind of look like a stamp or a ticket. And then this is like a little label to write on with a beautiful rose. And then here we have a whole sticker page, I think. Let's see if I can get. Yes, this comes apart as one whole page, so you can make yourself a journaling card, a card front, um, use it in collaging, whatever you want. It's nice. I like that. And then we have some more flowers, more labels. That's pretty. Mm, this is a beautiful... Oh, I like these books in sticker form. They might probably be easier to keep up with. So many different colors. It's so uh, beautiful. And there's a butterfly. Ooh, look at this purple page, y'all. That's pretty. Another uh, full page one. I like that it includes some full page ones that takes the guesswork out of card making and journaling cards and things like that. Beautiful. I love these. 
There's a bird. It's mostly flowers, but there are a few butterflies and birds. There's a girl with a bouquet of flowers. There's a few quotes in here. There's another one. Isn't that pretty? Another full-page one. And I believe this looks like one you could, uh, looks like a sticker sheet too. I'm not sure. I guess not. I thought it was one you could probably draw on yourself, but I guess it's just a page to help cover them up. That's very pretty. I like that. And remember, if you like it too, the links will be in the description. I'm going to save this one for last because I think it's more to look at. Um, let me get my magnifying glass because some of this writing is really light colored. Um, it says Mr. Paper, Summer Poetry Series Postcards, 30 Pieces, Original Illustrations. So let me, this comes in a little cute little box. And I found these products under the heading that said journaling supplies. Okay, if I can get this open. Okay, let's pull it out of the box. Uh, I think I want to tear the plastic all the way off so it has more room. How oh, isn't that nice? Look at these. These are all postcards. But they're like, uh, I guess, from China. Because it looks different than ours would on the... For the address and message and stuff. But it would probably still work. The summer poem begins with a bouquet of daisies. How nice. So they've got beautiful flowers and some quotes and stuff. Midsummer dream opened the knot. Do you never, so you never left me. Um, I don't get that one. But it's still pretty. <laughs> uh, the wind blowing through the midsummer yearn for free daisies to hold your hand to pursue that land. Uh, some of these quotes aren't making a lot of sense to me. But well, that one does. It says tender love. That's pretty. Even the ones with the weird quotes, I would still use them in a journal or something. Or use them in a collage. Full of dreams of the moon. So yeah, these are, and it looks like you might get two of each. I'm not sure. Or maybe they're all different. Yeah, I thought that was a repeat, but I guess not. Tender love is never late. That's a nice one. The love song of summer is a cool wind. Is it is a cool wind is a cool breeze. And some of them have Chinese characters on them. I assume it's Chinese. So yeah, they're very pretty colors. That one's really pretty. It has no words at all. That might be my favorite one. I like the soft colors. But they're, the card, it's really nice, thick card. Be very nice for, well, I guess you could mail them to people. Use them for your projects. 
but I don't think I should sit here and read every one, one of them. There's one with a whole big long one on it. Ooh, look at this. That's a pretty one. I don't know if the, some, there's a, has a little bit of glare. I don't know if that's bothering you guys or not. That's a pretty one. They're all pretty, actually. So these are really good quality and really beautiful and great for journaling projects. And uh, a few of the quotes are not quite um, translated right, but they're still beautiful. I wouldn't worry about using them. I'd, you know, unless you were sending them to a specific person to say a specific thing. Now that might make a difference. Okay, that's two products down. Now this is the last one. It's like a little kit. And let's see what we have in here. And I think it, yeah, it slides like this. Oh, and some of them stuck in there. A lot of them actually. So let's see what this says. Um, it says, all of it's in other languages, so I don't I have no idea. <laughs> it's just like a collage of different languages. But look at these cute little stickers. Really pretty. And kind of neutral colors. Oh, the little girl. Oh, another little girl. These are sweet. And they look like that they are... If I can get one apart. There we go. So, they're a little bit transparent. So, you can see the color of my finger. So, which is nice so because the border will not be stark bright white when you put it down. It's a globe. Kind of looks like a, a very s small miniature of a famous painting. Butterfly, little girl. A clock, uh, a pocket watch, a lot of little girls, those are cute. A key, a little um, paper, kind of like a scroll. I love these little girls, they're so sweet. That's pretty. Yeah, I love all these little stickers. There's a chair. So you get the picture of all of these beautiful stickers. This would be perfect for a journaling project. Now here we're getting into, these are just little papers. Um, that looks like one of those, uh, what do you call them? The thing you stand behind to change clothes, a screen, I guess. <laughs> And they're, they're, these are not stickers. They're just little pieces of paper, which would be great for collaging. And we have those as well as the stickers. though. So they're not as um, see-through. So the, the paper is a little bit more bright. So let's see what else we got in here. A oh, pretty tag one. And this is just a paper with some um, letters on it. You could probably cut out if you wanted to. To spell word, uh, some word or something. Quote, name. And look at this one. This looks like... Uh, for a tab, like one of those tabs, you would fold it. I believe that's what that is. There's a couple of those, and then we have this one. 
like just like there's some tickets I guess and here's some bigger papers that you could use to write on and we have these um I don't I think that's kind of like a calendar or something but a lot of pretty neutral colors here to play with. The paper, this is just regular, about the thickness of copy paper. But it feels like it's um, pretty good paper, even though it's kind of thin. So you got all, look at all of these. They look like, <clears throat> oh, is that supposed to be, that's like a receipt or something, but it's little. So really pretty little ephemera to play with. Very nice colors. And it just keeps going. Okay, now here, dig all of these out. I think we're getting to the bottom here. I don't remember how many pieces it says. I, I think it said 200, but I'm not positive. And yeah, I'd say there are 200 or more in here. And then these are just bigger sheets of um, paper, but they don't, I don't think they have a border on, any of these have borders. There's a sticker. So yeah, that just looks like beautiful collaged. Some of it looks like collages. Some of it looks like ephemera, like tickets and receipts. There's some poems. That's pretty, very pretty. I love this one. Cause you know I'm all into the bright colors, right? <laughs> and this looks like uh, sheets of paper but it's very tiny, like it's got the lines and everything. So, very fun. This is like a, a map of, of the world, like a globe map. So, that is a very pretty, fun little haul for y'all a little unboxing now remember go check out new craft day see what you can find for yourself in journaling or diamond painting and i believe they had some beading supplies and some different supplies like that see what you can find and use that martha 10 for a 10 uh 10 percent discount on your order and as far as I know, there was no limit, like, you know, like some places will give you a 10% discount if you order like $50 or something. There was nothing like that, I don't think at all. Just 10%. So order as much as or as little as you want to, I guess. So these are going to be fun to play with. And I will try, when I create something with these, I will try to remember to tell you where it came from. But I don't know that I'm ready to use them quite yet. I'm working on other things with of a different color palette right now. There you have it. There's my unboxing, a little journaling kit postcards and a sticker book i think my favorite out of all of it is the sticker book because i love all the pretty um colors the bright colors the flowers and it's great for spring and you know me i love stickers anyway so there you have it my new craft day unboxing Check out the description if you're interested in either one of these products. You will find the link. You will find a 
coupon code and you will find a link to the website. All right, I think I've talked enough about this and I'll be seeing y'all again soon. Bye now.